What is up guys, it is Nick. We are back and today we are going to be doing the daily quests at uh, Sousen's Garrison. So there are four quests here at Sarma's that you can take. Uh, agitating the enemy camp, uh, become the spearhead, so pretty much just defeat stuff at uh, Sousen's. And then we come over here to Latro and this one is for steel combat rations from Sousen Assassin. Okay, I can't take any more quests. All right. Gotta go get rid of some of my repeatable quests. Let's come all the way down here, and... Okay, I can ditch this quest. I know I have this completed, but whatever. Whatever, we'll toss that, and we'll toss this quest. Okay, so we can grab these now. So, we already went over that one, and then this one is to destroy tents and supply camps over at Thousands. I went ahead and made one upgrade to my armor, and that is I picked up a tri Gruno glove. So I'm going to get a full tri set. Um, I'm going for shoes next. I need 85 million to upgrade the shoes, and then I'll go for the tri helmet. So if we go into here and we go to armor, shoes, and we go down, no, never mind, it's at the top, Grunels. And here is the tri Grunel. It'll give me an 11-point upgrade in the defensive category. So my point is, is I want to upgrade my armor first. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to get rid of some of these accessories that give me some defense and go ahead and increase the offense. So like with the red coral ring, actually, that's a bad example. Like, yeah, the red coral, fine, the red coral ring or the outlaws ring. They give attack and defense, but if I go for... Uh, if I go to rings here, I'll probably probably be leaning Mark of Shadow. It's probably the cheapest ring that I can go with right now. Uh, it's kind of it's kind of the beginning ring before you get to like Ring of Crescent Guardian or yeah, Ring of Crescent Guardian. So I'd probably go for a duo Mark of Shadow. So I would lose the five defense and two technically two overall but i would gain three attack out of this which is what i need to be gaining and so i think that's good um and then i can always upgrade that to to a try mark of shadow but we'll start out with the duo it's an affordable price for me and so duo looks like it'll be it'll be the option there's also earring upgrades i need to get um either another uh, not blue coral. I need blue coral. I either need to get another duo blue coral or a tri blue coral to go over the red coral that I have. That would be a massive increase. I doubt that I go witch's earrings with the corals. I mean, obviously witch's earrings is better, but with the corals being the affordable price that they are, I don't know if I'll go for the 122 for the for the witch's earrings. Uh, it's just going to depend. I'd love to have upgraded my Toon Grad earrings. That would have been great. I would have had Pry Toon Grad, but, you know, I had to screw that up. So so we're in that tragic. Um, For this, not not Basilisk's Belt. Well, I could go Basilisk's Belt, but I would have to stop at Pry. But that would be 8, uh, which would not be bad. It would be an upgrade of 3, just like on the rings. And so that's what I'm leaning towards right now. Um... I could go Basilisks, but there is another option. Yeah, Tree Spirit. I could go for the Duo Tree Spirit. It would still only be 9, so it's kind of like, might as well just get the better the better thing. Um, I could also go Belt of Schultz Gladiator. The Duo is only 7, so it would only be a 2 increase. But uh, it's not it's not terrible. But there are, there are some decent options all over the place. Uh, if there was Pen Bears Belt, I would just buy that, but no one has any Pen Bears Belts up. Uh, so, let's get into this. Let me stop talking about the equipment that I need to level up, and let's go hit up Thousands, have a little bit. Don't know how long this is going to take. I'm not going to pop on double XP for this, just because I'm not going to continue to farm Thousands after I'm done with this. Probably going to take a break. I have been farming a lot today. Um, you will see the product of getting me to 58% to 58 tomorrow. I uh, spent three hours at Bashim's base trying to practice. Uh, like I said, like like you guys know, I mean, pretty much most of you know if you've been watching me for any sort of time, is that still relatively new to the game. Okay, can I 
can I get up here? Uh, still relatively new to the game and still working on, on getting better, uh, especially with my sorceress. Uh, she's my main. Looks like she's going to be my main forever uh, on Xbox. Just, I don't know. Nothing else. I like the name I have for her, and no one else has even come close. Lon is the closest, and I don't know. I, I don't like Lon as much, so... Actually, this isn't where I... This isn't, this isn't my rotation at Thousands. We're just going to do my basic rotation that... If there's no one here, I just want to do my basic rotation at Thousands for the daily today. Uh, I will have a video coming up eventually here going over Thousands where I'm not using the, the same spot that I used in the last video. But at least... Ooh, a heartfelt letter. Nice. So we can open up one of those in this video. Can open up one of those tragic boxes that I never get anything out of. It's just the big sad. I, I would like that to just go on record that it's the big sad whenever I, uh, whenever I open up those boxes. Now, what I've been working on is trying to use more skills and combos that isn't just the spin to win. Um, I did figure out a couple of different things here. So this is one of the things that I started doing is the Blade of Darkness into the Soul Harvest. Just a little bit of another skill to mix in there. And so I've been trying to use that more. And then also with this, if I hold the A button down, I can do a more uh, stronger and longer version of that attack. And it, uh, But the cooldown becomes a minute instead of 30 seconds. So that's kind of the, the payoff that you make. I've been using my... Um, I'm trying to use my, what am I trying to say, trying to use my uh, amulet spells or skills a little bit more. I still use a lot of the the same skills that I've always used, the spin to win and all of that different stuff, but I've been trying to incorporate some more stuff in. Um, it's going to be, a, it's going to be a process, but the goal is to have stuff actually be on cooldown, and I'm trying to use shards of, or yeah, my shards of darkness more. It's just I'm trying, you no, know, trying to trying to figure this out a little bit better. It's gonna take some time, but I, I think I think eventually here we're gonna get it. Get that down. I don't know why there was a there was like a massive delay there when I tried to use that skill. I, like, hit the RT button to do it, and then it was like, of course. I, Of course, we couldn't just get this video to be nice and smooth with me just by myself here. So hold on, let's wander over this direction. It can never, it can never be easy. That's, that's never how it's going to go. It's always, it's always got to be a challenge. So we're going to go on a little adventure today to get away from that guy. Who is currently farming? Okay. Okay, what are you farming, dude? Are you just, What is he farming? He, like, comes and farms my spot and then just leaves. Like, come on, bro. Like, wait. Either take the spot or don't take the spot. I don't really care. But figure it out. Figure out what you're doing. Is this tent destroyed? I guess not. It, like, wasn't taking damage. Couldn't tell. Okay, actually, you need to die, assassin. Come here. Go into this. I don't want to do the extended. Oh, you didn't die. Okay, so now let's come over here. I need to kill more assassins and tents. So we'll just knock two birdies out with one stone. There we go. Get the life harvest out. I still have, I'm still working on that timing of both using um, the LTRB skill as well as, um, oh, we got another heartfelt letter. Nice. I'm still working on trying to get used to all of that. I'm still not used to it, but working on it, trying to get the timing down. It's a little bit of a, I don't know, it's a little bit weird for me. But I, I, I can get it, and I will get it here. Just gonna have to bear with me while I kind of get that skill down in my rotation. Spin out of the corner. I just definitely need to. Definitely got some stuff to work on, but uh, hopefully. 
hopefully we'll get it we'll get it down here in the near future so that I'm not so I'm not a uh, right uh, right trigger and right bumper spamming that's something I really want on PlayStation I'm gonna do my absolute best I promise I'm gonna do my absolute best to actually okay can we you know guys I'm just trying to do my dailies I just need one thousand soldier can I please just just let me kill one thousand soldier oh my gosh there's oh my gosh here we go here we go here we go come here come here buddy come here you gotta die behind him and there's that down I don't know if I completed the other one. Let's kill these guys and then I'll find out. Put those guys out. Okay. Oh, look. Someone got a Mark of Shadow out of their box. I sure wish that I could get anything halfway decent out of my boxes. Uh, hurry up. Alright, so dailies are completed. And dailies were completed in about 11 minutes, so, so not too bad. I'm happy I didn't put the double XP on. We'll, uh, I don't want to, we'll just, you know, come down here. Hello, everybody down here. See, like right here, if I just hold A, this lasts a whole heck of a lot longer. It's really nice. I really like it that it lasts longer. don't like that it doubles the cooldown, but I do like that, uh, that I can use that for a longer period of time because there are a lot of rotations that I just don't use I just don't use that um, that skill all that much so it's like see like this is the timing that I'm trying to figure out is like do I need to be in like the flow of combat so we're gonna take a look at this in a second because I'm gonna mess it up tomorrow's video so just just be prepared in tomorrow's video. I'm going to mess this up again. Oh uh, my gosh, I don't want to take... Uh, I guess I'll just take him back. Okay, so let's go back to Sarma's. I was going to say, let us get... I mean, I guess I could, but... Let's go... Let's just go back. You know what? You know what? Let me stop. I'll come back here where I'm getting more items dropped. I got to take a look. And so in tomorrow's video, even if I figure this out, just remember, in tomorrow's video, I'm going to mess it up again. I have to get back. Okay, we're on the road. There's no way you're following me all the way out here. Yeah, okay. Go to skills. The skill that I'm trying to use is Blade of Darkness, okay? And so, it's just, I just don't use it, like, every time. So, like, see? It wants to do, it wants to do, like, that, that, this, which is just simply right trigger. Okay, that's all this is, is it's right trigger. And it puts up the shield. But when I hit LT and RB, you can see it just wants to go like that. So do I have to do it in the flow? Yeah, see, it doesn't even doesn't even work like in the flow of an attack. See, none of that did it. So it's like, I don't really want to add it to this because I feel like I should be able to use it. But it's just like, it just like doesn't work. Like, see, it just, like, doesn't want to work. It wants to use Karth Karshan's Protection. Okay, can I stop blocking? It wants to use Karshan's Protection. So, this is the type of stuff I gotta work on. What I'm trying to use is Soul Harvest. Um, but I need to use that certain skill to do it. I can use it straight off of an RB, which is nice. Which is what I'll probably start doing. It's just using it straight off of an RB. Because you, you you essentially use RB, hit A, and then hit A again, and it rips it back. So it's definitely it's definitely easier just to use it off of that. And I can even use it actually off of almost any skill. I was just trying to combo it with RT or with LTRT, but I don't really have to. But man, that is the biggest thing that I mess up is is this skill right here, uh, the Blade of Darkness. It doesn't, it doesn't say that it has to be, like, comboed. I guess, oh, it has to, okay, okay. It has to have the, the, the shards of darkness. Okay, 
So that's good to know. That's what I needed to know is that I need to have Shards of Darkness. I didn't actually notice that the first time. So, hey, I, fi I figured it out. I figured it out. You just got to do a little bit. But I think that I'm better off just doing this skill off of RP. I mean, obviously, I'm not going to spam it like that. But I feel like that's the better bet is to use that right off of RB than what I was trying to do. I mean, it was cool to use it off of what I was trying to use it off of, but... But I, uh, I think that's the better option is to, to, to RB to A, just RBA. I think that's the much better rotation of that spell to do. Um, like I said, tomorrow's video, I'm going to look like an idiot because I'm not going to know how to do that skill. But, uh, yeah, just, just know that that's what I'm trying to do. I want to try to incorporate the amulet a little bit more, so I'm still looking for skills that I want to use to incorporate that stuff. Uh, I don't even remember what I get for these dailies. So we're at 58.967. So let's see how much this gives us. And does this one? Yeah, this one gives me experience too. Okay, gives us about 0.3%. So not too bad to come up here and just knock out some dailies. This is going to give me some experience too. So our 59255. Yeah, it gave me about... 0.3 give me about 0.3 of a percent so it's not bad definitely worth it for me to come up here i'll probably in the future i don't know if i'll record it i'll probably record it from time to time but i'll probably come up here and do an hour at thousands every day do my dailies get that free 0.6 percent of a percent at this point it'll obviously drop when i hit 58 but at this point that's what it is and then i'll just farm thousands with double xp because the one good positive thing is right now is that I have a crap load of double XP. Oh my gosh, I got a plus eight Kriegs Miser. So that's not bad. I'm happy about that. Um, but I have, let's see here, I have 22, 22, 100%. We have five item drop uh, just there. And then in my pearl inventory, I have 11 more and 19 item drop in Kree scrolls. So definitely have enough of that to go around. I did pick up this Python chair would we pick that up like pick that up last video okay so now time to go to some imp some simple alchemy and try these boxes again can i get something this time game one time one time give me something one time please Ooh, we sold some yes oh my gosh i finally sold the stupid duo crea crescent pendulum i've been trying to sell that thing forever and it would not sell it's like the most tilting thing ever so, I have 88 million. You can't see me put it on right now, but uh, we can go buy those Grunel shoes. Because I'm doing the Grunel stuff first, and then I'm going to... Well, logically, this is probably not what I should do. I should probably get one piece of Grunel, then upgrade one piece of... To upgrade my attack. That's probably the correct thing. Let's do that. Actually, I want the two pieces of Grunel so I can get the bonus. Because, right... We want the the, 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 the two-piece, yeah. We want the attack up. So, yeah, I need to get the two pieces of Grunel. So, let's go ahead and get the shoes, and then I will definitely go for upgrading um, my attack. Let's go ahead and get this. Have just a... Maybe I don't. Nope, I don't have enough yet. I'm two million short. I'm two million short. All right, time to clutch it up, boxes. I need two million dollars. Time to clutch this up, so in the next video, I can have my Grunel stuff for sure. Oh, we got something what the de game deems good. What did it actually give me? Okay. Okay, sharp bright crystal. And we didn't get something good. We got... Is it is it two? Okay, it's two memory fragments. That's not too bad. That's not too bad. What did we... It's worth about 755,000. Not bad. Okay, so not too bad of a video. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed. Drop it a big old like if you did, subscribe if you have not, and I'll catch you guys tomorrow with a three-hour Bashim's video. Obviously, it's not three hours long. It's a lot shorter than that um, as we progress, and that will get us, so today is Tuesday, obviously. That's Wednesday. Then I'll have a video for Thursday. Not sure what it'll be yet. Probably just another farming video. And then howdy do, get ready for the beta and get ready for a bunch of videos. I will be using Berserker on the beta. Uh, and so I'm going to play it to level 50 because that's the max level for the beta. I'm going to play it all the way to level 50. I'm going to try to record a lot of it. I'll edit out garbage and obviously 
all the running that I do, I'll edit out. But I'm going to be getting that character to 50, and you guys will see all of that in the beta. That'll probably be my one experience with Berserker, unless I might make one on this account, like on Xbox. Probably won't make duplicate characters on PlayStation. Like, I want to play Ranger, and that's about all I want to do on PlayStation, is just have my Ranger. Um, I doubt I'd play a whole lot of other stuff. I'll probably play new stuff when it comes out, but overall, I'll just play Ranger. But we'll probably make a Zerker eventually on this, uh, on my Xbox, because eventually I'm not going to be able to just <laughs> be playing through characters anymore. I'm going to have to come up with other content, so we'll have to have new characters to do new fun stuff. But let me stop rambling on. We're back to the normal Nick, where I ramble on for five minutes at the end of every video. Uh, and so I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.